Hi everyone, so excuse my appearance. Today is very warm here in the East Midlands. So the sun is definitely out, summer is here, but I wanted to tell you a little bit about some of the new survey apps and websites that are out there. So I thought I'd just hop on and do this video. It's a bit of an impromptu video, so sorry about that. But first of all, if you do like my general life tips or you're interested in any travel tips, um, investment, then do check out my other playlists. I have quite a few on there. And most of them are uh, audio, so you can just listen in the background. You don't need to actually watch me unless you particularly want to. So today is all about surveys. As always, please do like and subscribe as well. It really helps me out. I do have a few other videos on these sorts of uh, apps like money saving, uh, money making, and also a Facebook page. I'll put the link in the description. And first of all, Rita is a fairly new app that now have surveys in it. They don't pay a massive amount, but they do have surveys that don't really take a long time to do. Like most of us say, I'd say maximum five minutes. And it's fairly easy to get paid. It's not vouchers or anything. It's just straight into your bank. You just need to get yourself set up with Stripe, which is fairly easy to do. If you already have an account that you've received payments before, then you just use that. And it just goes into your bank. It is a four euro minimum to withdraw, but they do have other um, ways to earn money. You can invite a friend and also refresh your data. So what Rita does is they help you control your data. So say they monitor what Google ads you've been going on. If there's a company that has your data that you don't want them to have access to, then you're able to submit a request for them to remove it. And it is your legal right to do that. It's a little bit fiddly, but what Rita does is they apply on your behalf. So they do all of the legal work all of those sorts of things. Um, and you do get a two euro bonus just for joining. Then if you refresh your data once a week for four weeks, then you do get another two euro. So it's really easy. If you're in Britain, it'll just do the conversion into pounds for you. And that's available in all of Europe. So the next one, Unbanked, this is a bit like Rita, but it's your bank data. Um, they do have a few surveys on there, but it's not so good as they pay out through gift vouchers um, and you have to email them to to get them. So it's not such a good one, but still worth doing every now and again. The other one is Amazon Shopper Panel. I do actually have a video that's specifically on that. The other one is Google Opinion Rewards. Now, this pays you into your balance of Google Play. So I think you do need an Android phone to be able to do that and a Gmail. But if you subscribe to Google One, which is quite good, you get more storage and a VPN, then you're able to use your balance from these surveys to pay for that. Or if you pay for any other apps, books, eBooks on the Play Store. So depending on whether or not you find that useful, personally, I do, but some people do prefer to have the actual money in their bank. It's worth it. Um, and the surveys are normally like one or two questions. They're really short. And the you see the money going straight away to your balance. So there's no messing around with it or anything. Um, I try to think what other survey apps have I been using? Those are the main ones at the moment. As always, like I've used before, Influence are still very good for video surveys. They normally pay 25p and you just answer like doing a selfie on your phone. Um, try to think what other ones that do surveys. We are eight is also a good one. It's not surveys, but it's watching ads. They're quite good because you only need one pound to withdraw and it's on PayPal. And then it's up to you whether you transfer to your bank or leave it in your balance. So I hope you found this video useful with those survey apps and that you're able to start to make some money. I do put different ones on my Facebook page as well. So do you have a look? If you know of any other ones that are particularly worthwhile, then there is also a Facebook group. It has the same name as the page that you're able to join and share. It's not just if you live in Surrey, people think they see Thrifty Surrey. And most of the deals are actually nationwide. So uh, most of these apps you can use 
um, across Europe, maybe the US, I'm not sure. Sometimes when you're traveling, you need to have your VPN switched on. If you don't already have a VPN, then like I said, Google One is a good one. There's also private internet access. You do get 30 days for free and a reduced price with my link as well for that one. That's really good because it has so many many different servers. So uh, they're, they're all over the world. Like if one doesn't work, just choose another one. You can pretend to be in the US, you can pretend to be at home, you can pretend to be in pretty much most countries of the world. So it just adds another layer of security to your internet connection as well. So it protects your data a little bit more. Um, it doesn't lock you out of sites when you're traveling as they get suspicious that you're logging in from a different place. It's, um, it's great for watching shows as well, like TV shows from other places. If, you, if the show you want is abroad or you're traveling and you want to watch shows from back home is also pretty good for that. So do you have a look at, at those surveys and those links? And if you want more money-saving deals, then check out my other videos. If not, I'll be back soon with another video. Hope you have a great day.